Yeah, I'm Naoki Aizawa from the University of Tokyo. So I'm very glad to have this opportunity to present my recent uh, research. Uh, nothing to disclose. So as you know, uh, during storage phase, uh, rather afferent sensory uh, input to the central nervous system increase. And the afferent nerve fiber were carried by myelinated A delta fiber here and a myelinated C fiber. A delta fiber is ro mainly located in the smooth muscle layer, and the C fiber is widely located in the smooth muscle layer to urocerium layer. In a previous, a previous study with CAT, uh, revealed that A delta fiber may play a role normal bladder sensation. On the other hand, C fiber does not respond to normal bladder sensation itself, but this nerve fiber uh, may play a role uh, in abnormal sensations such as inflammation or pain, so-called silent C fiber. But at least in rats, rodents, C fiber responsive to normal bladder sensation. Sorry. So we established the afferent measurement in rodents. So this is an experimental diagram of our experiment. And here is a more summarized experimental diagram. Uh, and animals were anesthetized with uretan, and the P50 catheter inserted into the bladder, and left, left pelvic nerve was dissected from surrounding tissue, and uh, stimulation electrode put on the, on the nerves. Uh, both L6 to the root were cut close to the entrance to the spinal cord, and fi finally fine filament were dissected from left L6 to the root. The nerve fiber uh, were classified as a delta C fiber with conduction velocity. And uh, after the afferent activity induced by pelvic nerve stimulation were ident has identified, but it was filled with serine until uh, intravertical pressure reached to the 30 centimeter water. This slide shows the afferent activity caused by pelvic nerve stimulation confirmed to co correspond with that caused by rather feeling, rather inspiration. Uh, for the analysis, the afferent activity, afferent measurement activity as firing rate here was evaluated in relation to intravertical pressure at each five centimeter water interval. Here's one of our results. Uh, this slide shows the ef effect of mirabegron, beta-3 adrenoceptor agonist, on single unit afferent nerve fiber activity. Upper trace is representative trace of A delta fiber activity, and lower one is C fiber afferent activity. Compared with uh, dr before ad drug administration, uh, mirabegron uh, significantly decreased the afferent activity in a dose dependent manner in the A delta fiber, and in C fiber, the afferent activity also decreased at the highest dose used of mirabegron. Interestingly, uh, Inhibitory action of afferent activity of A delta fiber appear to synchronize with decreased fluctuation in intravertical pressure, yeah, like this. So, in our further investigation under an isovolumetric condition, mechanosensitive afferent activity of A delta fiber, but not C fiber, significantly decreased after mirabegron administration, and this effect appeared to synchronize with uh, reduced. Heat Microcontractions of intravertical pressure. So, microcontractions may link to the A delta fiber afferent activities, and beta 3 adrenoceptor agonist mirabegron inhibits the afferent activities through the suppression of the microcontractions. Uh, there are a lot of pathophysiological factors of overactive bladder, and now we recently focus on the relationship between the my myogenic activity of the bladder and afferent activity. Previous human study reveals that abnormal mechanical activity of the, uh, were seen in the idiopacific unstable brother strip, but such, such activity was never seen in normal brother strip. In another study, by measuring the localized micromotion and intravertical pressure, a women with increased brother sensation had a significant prevalence of the micromotion activity, and more sustained micromotion activity were observed. Uh, at the same time, the patient felt urgency here. 
So such previous study uh, suggested that locally enhanced micromotion activity may contribute to development of urgency in OAB. Uh, in the animal study, with, in, uh, with an isolated whole blood preparation of blood outlet obstruction, BOO model, BOORAT, showed coordination of microcontraction was uh, enhanced by stretch, leading to increased pressure fluctuations. And as I shown in previous slide, microcontractions micro may be similar to micromotion, may be related. Uh, re related to the, to the mechanosensitive adrenal fiber afferent activity innovating the at least normal rat bladder. So we now evaluated the characteristics of mechanosensitive single unit afferent activities innovating the bladder in a male rat model of BOO and their relationship with microcontractions. In this experiment, we used male with rat and the animals were divided sham and BOO rats. To make partial BOO, uh, the proximal urethra was ligated with a uh, steel rod, and uh, then steel rod was removed. Uh, the sham, sham rat received similar surgery without proximal urethra ligation. At 10 days after surgery, afferent measurements were performed under urethra anesthesia. In this study, uh, bladder microcontractions were defined as uh, the pressure having more than 2 cm water of amplitude and the, as, the pressure ascending at 0.25 cm water per second or more, and the, dis, the descending at 0.15 cm water per second or more. The portion between two phases were defined as resting phases. Uh, here is the result of the number and amplitude of microcontractions. Number of microcontractions in Burat significantly higher than, uh, than that in uh, Shamrat. Uh, here is the uh, nerve activity in response to bladder distension. Interestingly, myelinated adrenal fiber significantly lower in blue rat compared with sham rat, but such uh, difference between the two groups were, never, were not seen in a myelinated C fiber. Here is a representative trace of adrenal fiber afferent activity and C fiber afferent activity in blue rat. If this area were expanded, intermittently enhanced afferent activity were seen observed uh, during microcontractions, uh, especially at ascending phases, A, ascending phases, in both A delta and C fiber. Here is an integrated result, and uh, the afferent activity at ascending phases during microcontractions in both A delta and C fiber significantly higher than those at descending or resting phases. So our male blue rats showed uh, increase in uh, number of microcontractions, lower mechanosensitive adult afferent activities, and enhanced afferent activities during the ascending phases of microcontractions. So now I interpret our uh, result of the blue condition. And here's the brother. And here is the urocerium in lamina propria and smooth muscle layer. Uh, it, it has been reported that uh, there, is, there, there is a gap connection in the smooth muscle. This gap connection may have a physiological role in uh, spontaneous activity. And under the BOO condition, uh, BOO caused hypertrophy. And in this study, we also, we also confirmed the hypertrophy. Uh, a high hypertrophy, and this hypertrophy lead to reduced uh, perfusion and hypoxia of the blood vessel. So finally, lead to ischemic condition. In this condition, uh, propagation of microcontraction was observed. This micro propagation microcontraction due to uh, occur due to several factors. For example, increase of the gap connection. Increase excitability of the membrane potential. And as I shown in previous slides, right, there are two types of afferent fibers, myelinated a delta fiber and a myelinated C fiber. a delta fiber is mainly located in the smooth muscle layer, and C fiber is widely located smooth muscle layer to urosinium layer. And previous study showed that BOO caused partial denervation, and in another 
another study with rabbit atherosclerosis model. Uh, Schwann cell, Schwann cell is the main component of the myelin sheath of the uh, peripheral myelinated fiber. So Schwann cell was damaged by ischemia in the rabbit bladder in atherosclerosis model. And in another study, in the rabbit peroneal nerve, peroneal nerve is also peripheral nerve, and myelinated A fiber were more damaged by ischemia. So such uh, previous finding maybe support our result uh, to that decreased the afferent activity of A delta fiber. So finally, uh, propagation of the microcontraction due to uh, increased gap connection or increased excitability of membrane potential caused intermittently enhanced the afferent activities of the mechanoafferents. So such uh, our pathophysiological findings may contribute to the urgency of the at least associated of boo. Thank you for your attention.